What's up ladies and gentlemen, today's question comes from our buddy Jason and I don't know if you noticed in the thumbnail there was a picture of a dragon and that's because this question and this dream is about a dragon. So let's get right into it. My, our buddy Jason has had two lucid dreams in two nights, okay? The first one was his first ever lucid dream and the second one was obviously his second lucid dream. In two, within two nights this happened, okay? Uh, so, in the first lucid dream, Jason says he flew around, okay, he saw something that he wanted to go and explore uh, f above a cliff somewhere, so he went and flew to that. And then in the second lucid dream, he was in his bedroom, he opened his closet door and saw a dragon, uh, and then he named this dragon Dragon Claw, okay. And then he said he imagined the dragon to be grown up. He, he was imagining to himself, I wonder what it would be like if this dragon was grown up. Uh, and almost instantly he says that it happened, okay, so he's, he must have just seen this dragon transform from a baby dragon, I'm assuming it was quite small, uh, to something that is much larger and I guess more aged, you know, there might have been like worn scars on it or something, so you know, indications of age, okay. Uh, and then the dragon was obviously in the room with him, and for some reason, he heard a voice. Uh, it doesn't say whether he heard this voice from the dragon itself or from just the dream itself. Uh, but he heard a voice saying, should I wake up now? Uh, and then he said, I assume in, in response to the voice, yes. Uh, he then woke up and did a reality check and found himself to be actually awake in his room. What does this mean? And what did the question, should I wake up now, mean? Who, who, who gave this question? to me, who sort of presented this. So it's kind of a, a weird thing to answer because it really depends on what you were thinking at the time. Uh, but generally speaking, when you hear a voice like that, uh, in this situation, I would say it's probably you uh, asking, or at least a part of you, maybe your subconscious mind asking you, should I wake up now? And this this normally has stems from uh, the belief that you shouldn't be able to lucid dream. So maybe you're as you said, you're fairly new to lucid dreaming, so this kind of explains it actually. Um, you're sort of new to the idea of having a lucid dream and being awake and aware in your dreams. Uh, and so because it's such a new idea to you, you sometimes think, well, this isn't natural, or maybe you feel like you shouldn't be doing it, or that it's something unusual, something that is sort of exciting, which it is, but also something which, <clears throat> for whatever reason, can't last long. Uh, and this is something that you can change, this is a belief that you can alter, okay? But yeah, so I, I would say usually that what has happened here, Jason, is you have um, sort of woken yourself up, uh, and this is something that happens to a lot of beginners, okay? I get lots of emails from people saying, you know, I had my first lucid dream, uh, and then I instantly woke up the second I became lucid. And this is, you know, this is usually what happens with beginners, uh, especially if this is, as you say, your second ever lucid dream. This is, uh, this is nothing to be worried about. This is, this is kind of normal, okay? So don't worry about it, and just keep practicing. And hopefully you'll have more dragon dreams soon. So if you have any questions, please leave a comment. You can email me at contact at howtolucid.com, and I will see you in the next video. What's up guys, thanks for watching. If you enjoy these videos and you like what I do on this channel, you can actually support me using the Patreon link down in the description, or I'll put one that will come here as well. And that's patreon.com forward slash how to lucid and uh, it's a way you can sort of support me um, with giving small monthly amounts and it really does make a huge difference to me and um, allows me to keep doing these videos also if you'd like to get a free lucid resource guide pdf make sure you click the link that should be in the corner here and i'll see you in the next video